What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'll talk about Battlefield 2042 and a lot of speculation within the community that the game could be delayed or they may have big issues when it's released. This has been a pretty hot top, uh, topic for the last week or so. A lot of people thinking that there's going to be some big problems and the game could be delayed, that it's full of bugs, all that kind of stuff. And where all this information is coming from is of course the closed alpha that just happened recently which was not supposed to be talked about. But of course as always things get leaked. Uh, of course images got leaked, a little bit of gameplay got leaked. Some people were even talking about the problems that were with, you know, kind of going on within the alpha itself. And the biggest issue is that there was a lot of bugs and, of course, the frame rate. They said they were not getting above 30 FPS the entire time. And I think a lot of people look at this and think maybe that's why we haven't heard about a beta release date yet. We're six or seven weeks out from the game's full release, and we still do not have an official beta date from DICE or EA just yet. Now, when they come out with an official date, I will make a video for that, let you guys know exactly when that beta is going to be. And of course, we know alpha and beta are just older versions of the game. So you're looking at the alpha probably could have been from four or five, six months ago. And of course, the beta version could be from a couple months ago. Following suit with most games nowadays, uh, you have a beta, of course, then they fix all the problems, have a big day one update. And that's supposed to be kind of, you know, what fixes the game in general. My issue with this, and we all can remember back to Battlefield 4, if you played it from day one, there was a lot of bugs, a lot of issues that went on with uh, Battlefield 1, Battlefield 5, Battlefield 4. Uh, all of these things had problems. Um, Battlefield 4 probably was the worst. Uh, if most of you remember, I'm not sure if all of you played from day one, but Battlefield 4 had some serious issues for a good long while. Even though it turned out to be one of the more successful games in the Battlefield franchise, and a lot of people loved it, the issues that came from day one were pretty serious, pretty game-breaking. And once again, like I said, Battlefield 1 and Battlefield 5 had their own problems as well. I think as a whole, DICE and EA are probably putting a lot of hope that you know this game's going to be a success and this game's going to do well and it's going to have big sales numbers and it's going to be popular and people will continue to play it because over the last several titles they have lost a lot of people in the community a lot of people did not like battlefield 1 battlefield 5 or even battlefield hardline and there's not been a big success a big modern style shooter uh, from ea and dice in a long time really since battlefield 4 and i think a lot of people are looking for that and i think dice and ea like i said have a lot riding on this so a lot of people are thinking that's why we haven't heard about a beta date yet because they're going to delay the game. That could be the case. And in my opinion, I would rather have a, a game that has a lot less bugs, a lot less issues. I mean, nothing's going to ever be completely bug free, but I think, you know, the better the quality of gameplay and things when it is released, the better this is going to be received by the community. And I think if it has to be delayed by a month, a few weeks, I really wouldn't have a problem with that honestly i don't think it would be a very big deal in my opinion now some of you may think differently but what do you guys think do you think that's one thing or, or one of the reasons we haven't really uh got an official date for the beta just yet like i said we are six to seven weeks out we probably should be hearing news about a beta already hopefully we're going to hear it very soon but i'm kind of curious what you guys think would you rather see the game come out in its current state if these issues are all true and all this is going to be a you know problem within the beta if the beta comes out and it's really buggy would you like to see a delay in the game because like i said in my opinion i think dice and ea have a lot riding on this and i think the less bugs and less issues the less problems will be better for them and also better for the community because a lot of people nowadays you know there's so many games out and so many different things you can play people don't hang around for you know games that have that have a lot of problems like they might used to when there's not as many options out there now there's a lot of options when it comes to video games so people just kind of move on from one game to the next if something has a big problem and they probably never will come back and play it again so let me comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky and Amazon Associates. Amazon Associates write us links some things that I use every day in gaming, some things you guys might like. So give that a look down in the description and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.